Hi, my name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is the equinox of planets. So let's first talk about what an equinox is and then talk about which planets have equinoxes and then kind of what they look like. So an equinox is when the equatorial plane of the sun is in the same plane as the equatorial plane of the planet. So equinox means equal planes. So here, this will be kind of the plane. So if you just extend out this distance, so directly from the equator, you just stand out this plane. That's the equatorial plane. And then let's say if Earth was here and the equatorial plane was about here, if these two planes are equal, then we have an equinox. So great. So this is when an equinox happens, when you have equal planes. Now, what planets have this. So if you don't have any inclination, meaning let's say if your North Pole and South Pole are 90 degrees from, from your orbital plane, then you have no inclination to the orbit. Therefore your planes are always equal, therefore you, your entire year is an equinox. But generally when we refer to an equinox is when a planet actually has an inclination and then and during the orbit it no longer has that perspective inclination with the equatorial uh, with equatorial plane of the sun and then it has uh, certain equinoxes and how it happens here on earth this is let's say you have the sun over here and this is sort of your orbits okay so at some point here if you have this inclination and the inclination for the earth is 23.4 degrees meaning that this angle over here is inclined from from the 90 degrees to 23.4 degrees. So at this point, if the sunlight is coming from here, you have this half lit. As you can see, your northern hemisphere is more lit than your southern hemisphere, meaning that you do not have an equinox. If you were to have an equinox, the north and south will be more or less equally lit. So here you don't have an equinox. Let's say you keep going, and in this side, as you can tell, they both are equally because the inclination is not facing directly at the sun, it's facing kind of sideways from the sun, therefore you have an equinox. And this point, you can see that it happens twice in a year orbit. So every six months, Earth has an equinox. So in fact, we have a vernal equinox and the autumnal equinox. So it happens for Earth every six months. Okay, so then let's talk about a couple of other planets that are kind of famous for their equinoxes. So the other planet that has a really high inclination is Saturn. And Saturn has an inclination of 26.7 degrees. And the orbital period around the sun is about 30 Earth years. So it takes 30 Earth years for Saturn to go around the sun once. Therefore, if this is six months for a 12-month orbit, uh, uh, Saturn will have an equinox every 15 years, which is half of its orbit. So equinox occurs every 15 years. Now, uh, Uranus is kind of notorious for its orbit because let's say if Uranus was here, the inclination of Uranus is actually 97 97.7 degrees, meaning that it's kind of rolling on its side than actually it's being tilted because it's nearly, uh, you know, it's nearly a right angle from the sun. So uh, for Uranus, um, the equinox happens every 42 years. And these are some of the extreme examples that we have here in the solar system about equinoxes. My name is Eileen Perez and I'm an astrophysicist and this is the Equinox of Planets.